Hey, this guy came and got me liquored up or offered me girls, and he wanted to know about this new neodymium dope yttrium aluminum garnet laser. <laughs> he asked what? Right? Like, yeah. my ears perk up. I'm like, really? And then find out the guy's actually not from an enemy nation. They just really wanted this technology for free. What is that laser for? There's things that are they're pretty much never going to be weaponized, things that are obviously going to be weaponized. And in between, you get this gray zone we call dual use, where you could come up with a laser that would be really good for brain surgery, and it would also, you could blind a satellite with it. A really good example I worked with firsthand was a radar system from a Navy warship. And so weather services started using actual Navy Aegis weapons systems to identify storms. And then all of a sudden, these certain countries start showing up and they're like, we too care about storms. What's this radar called again? And they completely knew that it was something we'd taken off of a Ticonderoga class warship. Because this laser could be used to blind a satellite or do a good thing. So that's the hardest part of the job.